What's up you guys, it's Adana, welcome back to my channel. For those of you... What's up you guys? It's Sonata. Welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, if you haven't already done so, take a look around. If you like what you see, um, go ahead and subscribe. So I wanted to make this video, um, man, because although I'm fairly private, I have brought you guys along on this journey and if I did not, um, you know, do this, then I don't think it would be authentic to inviting you on this journey with me. So that's why I'm making this video. Uh, and yes, so I took my boards a week ago and you know, like all week, like when I walked out of it, I was like, man, like I changed my answers. <sighs> I, I knew certain things were like wrong and you still choose it just because you're not certain. But yet, like, I don't, like, I don't know if any of you do that, but like you still choose the wrong answer, even though you know it's wrong, just because it's familiar to you. And so like, I felt like that after I took the boards and I was like, I was optimistic, but at the same time, I was like, man, like, I don't know if I pass. And this morning, um, the email came through. Like, they say that it's going to take about two weeks or you'll get your scores within two weeks. But, I mean, mine took literally seven days. Um, and the email came through and, like, my heart dropped because I was like, oh, my gosh, this is it. I'm going to see if I passed or fail. And, you know, I was like, what, like, like, what am I going to do in either situation, right? And, like, I have all these people that were, like, praying for me and rooting for me. And I don't know if depending on me is, like, really, like, the best term. But, you know, like, you have all these expectations on you. So, I was really stressed, like, honestly, like, all week. Um, but I was like, okay, it's here, so let me, let me open it. And so I came into the room and I told my husband, hey, I, um, I got the email, but I hadn't opened it yet, so I dropped my kids off to school and then I came back and I was, I was like, all right, he was like, do you want, do you want to do it now or do you want to do it later? And I was like, let's just do it now. <laughs> And, um, I opened it and when I pulled it up, I was like, okay, I don't even know where to go. Like it was taking a long time. I was like, I don't know where to go. So I went to exam and on there, it was like, you're eligible to register for the pants. And I'm like, well, you know, that doesn't really sound right. Like if I passed, why would I need to register for the pants again? So... There was an, another tab that says view your score. And so I clicked on that and it comes up. It shows you your date and, you know, the exam that you took. And then it says like pass or fail. And so mine said failed. And just like. <laughs> oh, you guys, I just. I'm pretty devastated, honestly, like, and it's not to say that I had anything lined up with respect to work or anything like that, but, um, a lot of, like, what I went into the test with and, like, just everything that I've been dealing with is, you know, like, I didn't want to disappoint anyone, so, like, I've been doing this and, like, you guys have seen me, like, you know, succeeding in things and it's hard to show when you don't succeed in something that you've been working towards and so for me 
like that was weighing heavy on me and I, like I like I didn't even know like the the stress of like okay so like you know how do I tell my mom and how do I tell like, my family and the people that have been like, praying for me like I don't want to be a disappointment to anyone and I don't want to let you guys down or you know feel feel like really like a failure um honestly like if I'm being completely honest about everything and so so it's tough and so I I wanted to make this video because I want it to be authentic and real with you guys just let you know like where I am in this path to becoming a PA like there were so many things weighing heavy on me like all those like negative and racist people that were like yeah like talk to me when you have to take the pants five times or something like that and you know like I just like I so badly wanted to like prove everyone wrong I guess you could say like I just wanted to do this and be like look like God did this for me and you know it's all like all for his glory and and this it still is you know like obviously like this is a learning experience and there's I can't sit up here and be like oh, okay like god left me or anything like that like it's nothing like that but i really um you know i just have to take some time because i did not fail like by much and like in my head i'm like look you you shouldn't have even failed period like it you shouldn't even be that close to the cutoff but um i was only like a few short points away from the cutoff but even still um I think a lot of what I went into the exam with, like the whole not knowing, just being super nervous um, and just kind of feeling like, oh, okay, like I have to do this. I have to make sure that I pass. Um, I don't want to let anyone down, any of my followers or subscribers or my family members. Um, not even really thinking about myself per se, but like I didn't want to. I don't want any of that. And like I didn't want to. I feel like so embarrassed that, you know that I didn't pass um, on this first time, but um, I'm gonna take it again. So I have to wait 90 days-ish before I can take it, before I can register for it. You know, obviously you can, uh, my dog's barking, I probably have a package. But anyways, like obviously I, you can take it any time after that 90 days, but um, I don't know what I'm going to do, like how long I'm going to take. I, I have three months, obviously, to study um, for this exam and retake it. And I will let you guys know how I do on that as well. You know, I'm going to always be authentic with you all. So at the end of the day, like that's what this video is about. Like I... <sighs> it's hard, you guys. Like... hard but I mean this just goes to show there are ups and downs and you know like not everything on social media and Instagram and stuff like is just about the happy times even though that's what we typically post and so I just kind of wanted to be real with you guys and just kind of let you in on where I am right now and um you know you know I'm gonna keep on with this journey and, and bring you guys along um, throughout this process uh, that I'm gonna go through next. Um, I don't know. I guess if you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below. And um, thank you guys so much for following me on this journey. Uh, as usual, I will talk to you guys next time. Bye.